Oh, hello everybody and welcome to the demo for... I don't... I, to, why do I always have to pronounce things that, like... I don't know how to pronounce. Uh, Musy. Yeah, that's what we're gonna go with. Alright, uh, contract, a task in hand, a brief inspection of the territory of the former industrial and extremely complex owned by NeuroWorld. The complex was built in blank in the main room. There is a large game room, also on a kindergarten for the children of the employees was built on the territory of the complex. The main component of the complex is a factory and office space. At the moment, the complex is a status of semi-abandoned. All right, so we're going to enter the contract and do an inspection. Um, do a report. Um, do a good job. And report it. Gotcha. It's like I'm an OSHA inspector. So I I can, I can relate to this. Run, crouch, interaction, and jump. Oh, look at this place. This place looks really nice. Can I go through this door? I can't. But I can play with the balls. Can I play with the balls? And... Well, I mean, technically... I think this counts as playing with the balls. Yeah. That's cool. Alright. Hey, she looks very nice. Yeah, she looks... She looks very happy. And uh, very chiseled. I think she works out. Alright. Away we go into this... Pretty cool place. Welcome. Well, thank you. Super soda, more ball playing. Oh, and blocking, breaking some blocks. Well, not breaking, but pushing them over. Oh, I forgot I was an ocean inspector. Uh. Okay, well, I mean, I think the balls are probably going to need to get put away. Oh, we got some candy. And. I need a key or something to get in. Um. This place is massive. Um, ooh, get a gift. Oh, not so easy. Oh, that's pretty cool. We got like um an egg with a hat flying over a planet. I don't, I don't, I don't really. I don't get it. Oh man, how many balls can we make happen? Oh, infinite balls. Eh. Ugh, that's a lot of balls. Hello, Mr. Toast Man. He looks pretty happy. High five. Oh, we got a lot of pictures that kids have drawn. Oh, these look so nice. Oh, it's a bear. Yeah, a frog and a, a happy man and... Uh, some kid also likes balls. Okay, well. Week 86, difficult way. What is that supposed to mean? I gotta say, I'm not so sure that these kids should be drawing all over the walls and stuff, but... They seem to be pretty talented for kindergartners. Oh. Well, this is definitely an OSHA violation. Uh, when it comes to the sparks, that's not... That is not okay. It is a fire hazard. I'll write that up in my checklist. Do I have a, no, I don't think I have a checklist. Oh, we're just going to leave that alone. Um. Aside from, like, just running around and making a mess... I'm not real sure here of what to do. Oh, wait. I feel as though 
I figured it out. It is a matter of pushing the right buttons, perhaps. Huh? Alright, we'll turn off all the lights. Maybe that's what we need to do. Okay, I want... Okay. I guess that wasn't it. Well, crap. I don't know what to do. How am I supposed to continue onward? If all the doors are... All the doors are locked. And is a dead end? Um, I don't have a key. Uh, to do the gift. Uh, that door is also locked. What if I can... Dang. Alright, so uh, trying that would say that the whole kick in the thing doesn't seem to do anything. Um... Oh, it looks like there was something glowing here. Yeah. We've got a gun. Open a large room with a gun. Shoot at the targets above it. Sweet. I guess I have to do this in a specific way. They... That's not the middle one. Alright, that was weird. I kind of felt like no matter what I did, it wasn't the right thing to do. Alright, we got a little, I don't know, spermy monster. Snake jumps. Sounds cool. Aw. I can't go in there and do it. Fun zones. Oh, I can't go in the fun zones either. On the slippery parkour, that, oh, this one looks amazing. Dang, I can't go do it. It sucks. And the Bakpi Bay maze. I don't know about the maze. The maze seems a little less exciting. Okay. What's that? Did I do the thing I was supposed to do? Oh, I wanted like a star thing. Oh, we had things to climb. Great. Interesting. Okay. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, it's, um, nothing. Okay, it shows green, but I can't do anything. What are, what are, look for keys to the barriers and pass all the tests. Like, super not helpful. Um, I need keys. I don't know where the keys would be. So it's far more puzzle-oriented than I thought it would be. Eh. There we go. Blue key. Fun zone. Find the orange key. Uh, if I was an orange key, I'm just going to be like... Probably somewhere. I forgot that I'm an ocean inspector and I'm just having a fun time uh, playing in this area. It doesn't make me a bad ocean inspector, it just makes me childlike at heart. 
Interesting. Orange key found. Huzzah. I'm a little less um, inter or a little less thrilled about this snake jump. Zipping all those plays whose figures are lit, green on the scoreboard. Um. Oh. Uh, X. Some kind of triangle symbol. Plus and a circle. Plus some triangle. Did it. I'm the best. Ow. I feel like I'm in Squid Game right now. Circle, circle, circle. Where are you, circle? Square. Okay, this one's hard. This down to easy. Like, I don't... I don't get it. I mean, it definitely seems like I have to get them uh, at a certain speed. Okay, I did. Circle, smiley face. Another circle. Triangle and square. There's an X and a plus. That that definitely makes it kind of difficult. Uh, they look the same, like this is um, a plus. I guess that's the X. Maybe? I, I, I'm actually not sure, so that's kind of frustrating here. I obviously need to get this done properly, but Square, triangle, really? I don't like this one. Square and then a plus. No idea if the plus or the X or the, is the right one. I have no idea. It's all about the angle, uh, so it's like impossible for me to tell. Uh, really, that's 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 absolutely asinine. You have to make sure you get off of it, I guess, pretty quick. I don't know if I'm succeeding, if I'm failing, I... I don't... know. Like, I don't know if things are getting better or worse.
Okay, now it's all of them. Thank goodness. What a terrible puzzle. Thanks, Mr. Snake Man, for the... for the thing. Alright, so, Slippery Parkour. Jump and get the key from the top shelf. Use shift key for big jump. I gotcha. I am, uh, I can parkour. Maybe. Um. Maybe I can't. Okay, well. Yeah. Well, dang. This is like one that I really wanted to like. Like, I really wanted to like this game because I was like, oh, it looks really cool and it's... I got to be an ocean inspector and weird stuff happens. Um, but when it comes to the, the... Like, this portion is more of a frustrating experience than anything else. Um, wow. Come on, just... Just jump onto the thing, dude. Oh my god. I have no feet, so I can't really determine how close to the edge I am at. I have to guess. Uh, and that's super frustrating. Because you have to be, like, right at the proper edge for this, and... I'm not at the proper edge, I like, But I have no idea like, uh, how close to the edge I am, because I'm just a floating head or something. Ah. Uh. To say I'm frustrated would be an understatement. Well, it's sad that this is going from like a game that I was very, very excited about playing uh, to a game that I never want to touch again. Um, I have like low tolerance for, I guess platforming that I think is um, bad. Great. Absolutely wonderful. Do you want me to get all the way up to the top of that platform? But I can't because I can't see what I'm doing for my jumps. Um, which means I can't progress because I cannot get the final key that I need. To continue, which means that um, this is going to be a waste of experience and time for me, and that will make me sad. Um, I so I I was definitely enjoying it up until this point, um, but this platforming sucks. Like I'm not gonna lie, like it's it's incredibly frustrating because I I don't know. Uh, exactly where my feet are supposed to be, so it's very difficult to time this jump properly. Uh, or any of the jumps that I have to make. And it feels like I'm often jumping too far. Or not far enough. Or like that, like I jumped just slightly too far. I'm gonna try it one more time. If I don't get it this time, like, I'm done. I'm still gonna post this video because I think leading up to this point, the game is quite nice. It's got a really cool setting. The graphics are really nice. I'm still talking, so I won't count that one. Um, the graphics are really nice. The sound is good. Uh, I like the, you know, the... I don't really want to call it physics because it's just some things move around, but... Uh, the interactions with other things are pretty fun. But, again, for me, when it comes to this jumping portion, it could be the only jumping portion in the game that requires this level of precision. Um, I have no idea. 
but the inability to really gauge where I need to be for the landing means... Oh, jeez. This is, it just becomes overly complicated and difficult to do the jump, and I don't enjoy that. And um, if I'm not going to enjoy it, then I mean, like, there's no point in me continuing. Um, at this point, like, I'm trying just out of pure spite, but um, the enjoyment factor is gone. And I no longer am concerned with seeing what happens with the game, because, uh... You know, my job as an ocean inspector would end right about the part where I had to jump from different things, but I couldn't see where my legs were, so I have no idea how to gauge um, that jump. So, yeah, I guess, um, I guess this is... This is it. It's definitely frustrating because obviously I'm getting really close. But that's that's whatever, man. This is stupid. Like that's like a terrible, terrible design towards jumping. Like if we're gonna have precision, we need to see feet. We need to be able to see what we're doing. Um. So yeah. Look, I can see help. Yeah, just tell me what to do. Yeah, cool. Can I just shoot the key off? Maybe. No. Nope. All right. Well. <sighs> Links in the description if you want to try it. You are more than welcome to try the demo. Maybe you'll have a better chance at the slippery parkour than I will. Um, unfortunately for me, the slippery parkour is um, well. It just seems impossible for me to do on account of not really being able to tell where I'm jumping and getting the timing right. So. As much as I want to like this, this is one I won't be coming back to. It's not going to get a recommendation from me just because of this portion right here being uh, just a, such an aggravating and frustrating experience. But otherwise, it's a really cool looking game. Like, I really like the visual style. The sound is acceptable. It has a lot of things that make me want to like it. But this slippery parkour can burn in a fire. <laughs>